talk to you all about this grep life bath mat um but it's not going to be able to be used just for a bath mat really you can use it anywhere where there's water so um maybe like by the pool um here dishes multiple different things like with um dog bowls anything it's gonna be really great so we have ours as a bath mat um and as you guys could see it comes very packaged well um you do want to make sure you rinse it first just to get any residual off and as you guys could see it was like drying as i was getting it wet it is um, something that you do want to make sure that you are careful with it because you don't want to crack it. Um, and then it comes with the non-slip pad. That way you can put it right where you need to and not have to worry about it sliding around on you. Okay, so as you guys could see, the moment I stepped out, it was able to, you could see the wetness and then it kind of it go down as I was like stepping off of it. And it dried really quickly, did not leave water anywhere else. A lot of times our bath mats that we've used in the past, it's still wet. And even when you pick up the bath mat, like underneath wet, and it's just, it's just not fun. Um, and so this is going to be very eco-friendly. Okay, you guys, it's going to have 100% pure diatomaceous earth. Um, and so because of it having that stone, if you get any kind of stains on it, light stain, you can just kind of like kind of clean off. If there is a heavier stain, it does come with this sandpaper right here for you to be able to stand away to be able to get any area. And then you can just go ahead and rinse any of that stuff off um, to be able to be used. So I like the fact of that. So you're gonna be able to clean it. It's gonna last you for a really long time and you don't have to worry about getting water all over the place. So thank you guys so much for watching the review and definitely recommend going out and getting this mat. Again, it is going to be moisture wicking and super absorbent as you guys saw. So thank you guys for watching.